Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition. So last time we took on our first boss of the game, the Pride Demon, and we somehow failed to shut down the main rift at the same time. We fell unconscious, woke up here, I forget the name of it, but you know, we'll find it out eventually I'm sure. And then we, I didn't mean to speak to you. God damn it, why does jump have to be on the same button? Go, go up there. It's not gonna work. <laughs> Whatever, I'll take the long way around. But so yeah, then we formed the Inquisition, which I believe is a kind of army that we're building. Still not entirely sure why we're building it, but damn it, it's cool nonetheless. So yeah, we have to run around and speak to some random NPCs, assumably to, you know, get gear for our, our soldiers and shit, even though we don't really have any right now. Apothecary. Okay, so we can find recipes. Oh, we can upgrade potions. Interesting. Uh, probably here. Okay. I get the feeling there's a lot of complicated shit in this game, and I probably should really be reading this. Okay, so... Green is health, blue is, you know, supportive stuff, and red is grenades. It's not really a potion, but whatever. Okay, so, if we have enough resources, we can upgrade our healing potions, and we need 20 freaking 5 elf roots. Which, unsurprisingly, we don't have. But luckily, we do have the one rare herb that we need, the lotus. And hey! Let's sure match your booty to loot here for once. Fine. Don't Nobody mind me. I'm just gonna rob you. Fine. Oh, we got oh, some, uh, some more face paints. Don't know if it's better than what we have. It's kind of hard to tell. Speaking of which, I guess we should check it out. And yes, I'm finally getting used to the controls again. Eh? Hey, where the hell is the face paints? Okay, so that one's new. So how do I compare it to what I have on? Okay. Seems to be worse, I guess? I mean, like, one's critical damage, one's critical... I... I don't know. Who really cares? Hello? Ha! <laughs> Look who's back from the dead. Again. I shouldn't be surprised. You oxmen are tough as old leather. Thanks, I, I think. We've met? I don't recall meeting you before. I'd be surprised if you did. You weren't particularly coherent. Someone had to patch you up after you staggered out of making those wear, though. So, you're welcome. Ah, okay, so that was you. And we're not done yet. Until the breach is closed, no one's safe. Make True. it. I'll keep the bandages handy. Name's Adan. I'm in charge of keeping our little band here stocked with potions and elixirs. Not that Seeker Pentagast seems to care whether we've got the supplies to actually do that. What a dick. Okay, so how do I order potions? How do I go about having potions made? Just take a look there and tell me what you'd like. Find a recipe for something better, I can make that too. Ah, interesting. So you can make potions and apparently I can... I can equip them? Ah, you can equip potions, healing potions, blah blah blah. Okay, healing replenishes automatically. Interesting. And assumably one's grenades, one's the toxin stuff, and we can maybe only have one of each type at once? Oh no, but everyone's full at the moment, so whatever. You're back. Yes. And in one piece. I never left. Need any help? Is there anything I can do to help out? We're fine as far as raw labor goes. You've more important things to do than tend to me. I only wish I'd been able to find Master Tajin's notes. Old bastard was working on something special. He died at the Conclave, and his notes weren't here. Been too busy dealing with the wounded to look for them. Okay, cool. Sounds like we found a side quest. What's investigates? Eh, I gotta. You're a bit cranky, ain't you? For a healer, you don't seem particularly nurturing. I'm not a healer. I'm an alchemist who's forced to play Mother Hen. You want something to burst into flame on contact with the air? Done. Gladly. Patching up wounded soldiers is a waste of my time and talents. But there are a few around who can help. Well, all right then. Farewell. <laughs> I love the fact that he wasn't really cranky. And then I'm accusing him of being cranky and that in turn made him cranky. It's enough to make anyone freaking cranky. Oh, shut up, you. No one cares what you have to say. Hey, you sound like a... A bar or something. Grey Warden? Can I get you anything? How about a date, baby? What can I find in Haven? What can you tell me about this area? Adan is Haven's apothecary. He's been making potions and tending to the wounded as best he can. Harris is the Inquisition Smith. Whatever he can make you, Thren the Quartermaster can probably find. And for anything fancier, you can try buying from Segret. His prices aren't too high. Yet. 
Oh, there's also my knave. She studies beasts and things, as I understand. Thanks. Farewell. Goodbye. Is the world the will for this Now sing Dragonborn comes. To come is fire in the end of time. It almost kind of sounds very similar. Not that I'm accusing anyone of, you know, ripping off Skyrim or anything like that, but I'm just saying. Kind of sounds like she's singing about me. Maybe that's my ego. I don't know. Anyway, it looks like we can't do much else in here, so let's leave. And yes, I realize we just exited from a different door to the one we came in and then ran around the circle, but what do you want from me? And yeah, I remember we couldn't actually loot this before because some chick kept interrupting me. I don't know what it means by, like, uh, utility slots and, you know, defensive slot, etc. I have no idea. I have no idea. I'm sure there's some kind of upgrade system that we'll learn about later, but right now... Kind of confusing as shit. Is a blessing upon his parents and onto the makers. This is true. This is very, very true. Okay, so anyway, it looks like we need to find the the smith around here. I'm guessing this is a gate? No. That's two pieces of wood. That looks like... <laughs> yeah, man, that totally looked like a fake gate to me. I guess there's like a couple around here, but uh, yeah. Well, I guess we need to go down here and open the door. I'm hoping this isn't going to take us into a whole new area and, you know, like, spend 20 minutes loading, but, oh. Okay, good. So it should be just out here. Why are you in the town with the rest of the people? You dick. Hey, you and might be working up a thirst. She sent me over to see if you needed anything. The hell was that? I don't know, but I'll take it. What up, Cubal? Expected you'd be by. I'm Harriet. And everyone knows who you are. Damn right. How's the new gear fit? Eh, uh, quite well. Sturdy and warm. It's perfect. Good. World's gone mad. Stock armor and blades are good against bandits, but we're not fighting bandits. My gear will see you through demons, apostates, whatever this world throws at you. So, you need custom work. Something special. You bring the materials to us, we'll make it happen. Are you talking about narcotics? And can you help improve my gear? Can you help improve my arms and armor? Yes. If you find a new piece, a pauldron or greaves, we'll take care of you. You can't just slap a new hilt on your sword in the field. Bring it here, we'll make sure it's done right and proper. Good and proper, geezer. And do you have any designs? If I want something, what can you make? Start simple. Something to keep you safe. Take a look at it on the table there and we can talk. You'll need materials. We should have what you want just outside. Okay, uh, I guess we'll check out Investigate. Do I want to ask any of this to you? No, not really. Get out of my sight. Goodbye. Right. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, so, uh, what the hell is this? Crafting. The crafting the armor weapons, you need a schematic and enough materials. Okay, seems simple enough, and sounds like the better materials you use, the better gear you get. Also seems simple enough, and yeah, we bought these schematics earlier from uh, the the merchant guy whose name I simply can't remember, and let's be honest here, never gonna remember it. I can't even remember the names of the people I work with, who I have for years. It's not gonna happen. Okay, so, I think I kind of understand what this is getting at. Kind of. Interesting, so you can make it utility, defensive, offensive, blah, blah, blah. Interesting. This is like one freaking complex crafting system, dude. Holy shit. Well, we only have iron, so I guess we don't really have much of a choice right now. You crafted brutal sets. Well, that sounds awesome. Probably is not. Let's be honest here. Yes. Okay, so what table was he talking about? I guess this one? Modification. Okay, so we can upgrade our gear as well. Looks like we don't have anything to be doing that right now, though. That's kind of sucky. Oh, how cool does my staff look? I want to shoot you right now, but I can't. Uh, yeah. Don't look like we can do much with that right now. But good to know nonetheless. There's a crafting bench here as well. Oh, does the same thing. I'm relieved about that. Oh, I can buy and sell here as well. The Tactician's Renewal. And yeah, unique, okay, so purple should mean that an item's unique. I don't see how this is unique though, because there's two of them that have the same name. Whatever. 
And yeah, from the description of that, why is this one one coin and the other one's like 300? From the description, it sounds to me kind of like it resets uh, all of your stats, like uh, your skill points, maybe. So you can, you know, if you mess up, you can redo that. So I guess they sell you one of them for one coin, so, you know, you get it on the cheap, but he seems to have unlimited of the other ones. But they're going to cost a lot more. Maybe they'll go up in price later in the game again. Hey, we got a staff schematic. Apprentice staff. I can only assume that's going to be better than the lightning one. But uh, I'm not even going to bother to check it right now because there's no damn way we got the materials for that shit. But uh, yeah, we'll try and remember to come back to that. Okay, so what the hell is this blue thing? Is it the bunny? Is that even a bunny? What the hell are you? It's like a pig cross with a rabbit. It's like a skinned rabbit. That's disgusting. Is that my imagination? It's all pink and stuff. Get away from me. Stop following me. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this building. I'm guessing this is just like where the smith lives or something. And he seems to have jack shit for me to steal. Well, that sucks. I guess we're going back to the town. I'm glad there are big, strong men around. <laughs> You're damn right, I'm big and strong, baby. Okay, so, uh, don't look like we can do anything over here, but we can stand here and watch them fight. That's kind of cool. I'm not going to bother, though, because let's be honest here, that's going to be kind of boring, especially on video. Right, so yeah, I guess I'm going to check around the town very quickly, see what else we can loot from the buildings. We already looted most of them, but there's bound to be some more booty around here, so I'm going to try and loot everything I can. I will probably cut it out, because let's be honest, you don't really want to see me just running around grabbing shit. It's going to be boring. But uh, I'll try and keep a track, you know, like a mental note of what I've picked up and just give you a quick overview. So yeah, I'm going to loot the town and then I'll bring you back in when we're ready to carry on. So, give me a moment here. Okay, I believe I looted pretty much everything. I found a bunch of more elf root or whatever the hell it's called. Not quite the 25 that we need to upgrade our potions, but quite a few. I got uh, two or three pretty decent daggers. I also got some more schematics. And that's about all. I also got a belt of cold resist, which I chucked on our main character. And that's about it. Wow. That pop-in. Does it trouble you? The pop-in? Well, a little bit. Uh... You mean the mark? Where does it come from? I just wish I knew what it was. Or how I got it. We will find out. What's important is that your mark is now stable. As is the breach. How do you know? You've given us time, and Solas believes a second attempt might succeed, provided the Mark has more power. The same level of power used to open the breach in the first place. That is not easy to come by. Well, sounds like fun. What harm could there be in powering up something we barely understand? Hold on to that sense of humor. Who says I was kidding? May I present Commander Cullen, leader of the Inquisition's forces. What up? Such as they are. We lost many soldiers in the valley, and I fear many more before this is through. This is Lady Josephine Montelier, our ambassador and chief diplomat. You're even taller than I'd heard. And of course, you know Sister Liliana. My position here involves a degree of... She is our spymaster. Yes. Tactfully put, Cassandra. A pleasure, I'm sure. Pleased to meet you all. I mentioned that your mark needs more power to close the breach for good. Which means we must approach the rebel mages for help. And I still disagree. The Templars could serve just as well. <sighs> we need power, Commander. Enough magic poured into that mark. Might destroy us all. Templars could suppress the breach, weaken it, so... Pure speculation. I was a Templar. I know what they're capable of. Unfortunately, neither group will even speak to us yet. The Chantry has denounced the Inquisition, and you specifically. No, oh, that was quick. That didn't take long. Shouldn't they be busy arguing over who's going to become divine? Some are calling you, a Gunari, the Herald of Andraste. That frightens the Chantry. The remaining clerics have declared it blasphemy. And we, heretics, for harboring you. Chancellor Roderick's doing, no doubt. It limits our options. 
Approaching the Majors or Templars for help is currently out of the question. So, what does the Herald of Andraste even mean? Just how am I the Herald of Andraste? People saw what you did at the temple, how you stopped the breach from growing. They have also heard about the woman seen in the rift when we first found you. They believe that was Andraste. Even if we tried to stop that view from spreading? Which we have not. The point is, everyone is talking about you. It's quite the title, isn't it? How do you feel about that? Yeah, I like it. I don't mind it at all. People are desperate for a sign of hope. For some, you're that sign. And to others, a symbol of everything that's gone wrong. So I'm the Messiah, and the Breach doesn't worry them? They aren't more concerned about the Breach, the real threat. They do know it's a threat, they just don't think we can stop it. The Chantry is telling everyone you'll make it worse. There is something you can do. A Chantry cleric by the name of Mother Giselle has asked to speak to you. She is not far, and knows those involved far better than I. Her assistance could be invaluable. Okay, so why would she help us? Why would someone from the Chantry help a declared heretic? I understand she's a reasonable sort. Perhaps she does not agree with her sisters. You will find Mother Giselle tending to the wounded in the hinterlands near Redcliffe. Look for other opportunities to expand the Inquisition's influence while you're there. We need agents to extend our reach beyond this valley, and you're better suited than anyone to recruit them. In the meantime, let's think of other options. I won't leave this all to the Herald. I like that title. Okay, so in other words, if I go break some kneecaps, we could recruit some people. You know, you gotta strike the fear of God into people, especially if I'm gonna be the Messiah. Yes, I will rule with an iron fist. Okay, so it sounds like we got some kind of a war table thing going on here. I suspect this will probably confuse the crap out of me, so if you know what you're doing, be prepared to be probably frustrated as bulls watching this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Okay, so it looks like we can get perks for our war inquisition -y stuff as well. Yes, that is the technical term. War table, exactly. Okay, so... Perform scanning missions, and we'll unlock the ability to go to new areas by the sounds of things, and, you know, gain more influence and thus more power. And I want that power, man. Okay, so... Mother Giselle was last seen in the hinterlands outside Redcliffe, tending refugees who fled fighting between renegade Templars and apostate mages. The latest report suggests that the vicious struggle between the two groups has spread to the hinterlands, catching the refugees and Mother Giselle in the middle. It's vital to protect her and, if possible, restore order to the area. Alright, I'll try, but you know, no promises. I'm not sure who's on our side, so I don't know who to root for. I think we did good. Maybe? I, I don't really know. Okay, scout the hinterlands. Uh, okay, so we've got like a mission report. New area unlocked. Uh, I, you know, I'd, I'd say it sounds like we won, except. And uh, will I like to travel there with my party, you damn rats? Party selection. We only have three. And it looks like we can only have maximum of four, and obviously we have to have us, so. I guess we don't have much of a choice. Maybe you can take less than that, but why would I do that? That's just silly. Herald of Andraste. I've heard the stories. Everyone has. We know what you did at the breach. They might not know much about the Canari, but you'll get no backtalk from anyone here. That's a promise. I better know. Inquisition not. Scout Harding, at your service. I, well, all of us here, will do whatever we can to help. <laughs> Harding, huh? Ever been to Kirkwall's High Town? I can't say I have. Why? You'd be Harding and I... No, <laughs> never mind. Ugh. Pretty sure Dragon Age 2 was sent Kirkwall. Okay, so what's the word out here? What's the situation out here in the Hinterlands? We came to secure horses from Redcliffe's old horse master. I grew up here. 
And people always said that Dennett's herds were the strongest and the fastest this side of the Frostbacks. But with the Mage Templar fighting getting worse, we couldn't get to Dennett. Maker only knows if he's even still alive. Mother Giselle's at the crossroads helping refugees and the wounded. Our latest reports say that the war's spread there, too. Corporal Vale and our men are doing what they can to help protect the people, but they won't be able to hold out very long. You best get going. No time to lose. <laughs> I always love it in video games when someone stands there casually talking to you for like 20 minutes and then they're like, but yeah, you know, you're in a rush, so you better go. It's like, what? There was no emergency in what you just said to me. You're like having a casual conversation with me. Like, what the hell? I mean, it's not a huge deal. It's just kind of funny to me. Okay, so it looks like we've got like a mini camp here. It's interesting. I don't really know what resting does. I mean, I assume it fully heals us. Don't know if it passes the time because it, you know, obviously the game has a day and night cycle. I don't know if the time of day actually matters. Maybe you can only do missions at certain times. I have no idea. I have no freaking idea whatsoever. Okay, let's go check out over here because it looks like. Hello? Word for you. A report. What is it? Could prove useful, sir. Oh, okay. So she gave me a schematic. Well, all right, that was kind of random. Didn't really expect that, but uh, I thought it was going to be some random side quest where she's like, yeah, go kill ten bears and bring me their asses. But it uh, didn't happen. Oh, there's a pathway here. Good. I was kind of worried I'd have to go all the way around to the left. And I'm lazy, you know? I'm a lazy, lazy freaking man. And that's why I'm jumping down Watch here and hurting step. myself. <laughs> Too early for that, buddy. Mother Giselle should be somewhere nearby. Yeah, you'd hope so. Oh, dead bodies. Don't know if they're good guys. Again, it's... What the hell? Um... <laughs> I guess the game was loading? That was weird. I could move the camera and everything. Well, all right then. We're in a giant purple circle now. Inquisition forces. They're trying to protect the refugees. Looks like they could use a hand. Wait, what? I thought we were the Inquisition. Everything I thought I knew was a lie. <laughs> What the hell? We are not apostates. I do not think they care, Seeker. What the hell are we? And yeah, we are nearly level four. That makes me happy. And so does this. Boom! Yeah, but yeah, it was okay. Okay, so hey, free booty. I assume that's a dude I just in fact I think I don't know where the hell that came from. Whatever. Oh hello, buddy. Just you? On your own as a fella Ow! Dick! Nice to see you. I wonder if setting them on fire on freezes them. I d d Whoa! <laughs> Holy shit, I just got an achievement. I don't know if that will show up on the video, but that was so freaking loud. Good lord. What the hell, Origin? What the hell? Did someone just say form of? Form of? A beast? I don't know. <laughs> and damn, you got messed up, son. Shocking! I was already dead. Be I ready. If, like... More coming our way. Oh, that's fine, bro. Don't worry about it. Looks like we got an important item there. Don't know what the hell it is, but uh, yeah. Anyway, let's go spend our skill point very quickly. Don't really. I probably shouldn't go for fire. We already have two fire spells. I really don't want to want to pick though. Kind of want to go with lightning bolts, Mister Lightning Bolts. Oh, uh, we can't do it right now. I guess that's because we're fighting? That's really annoying. Well, fuck yeah, I guess we'll do it later then. That's, again, it's kind of annoying because I wanted to use, you know, our new our new ability. You know, test it out whilst we're fighting, but I guess we don't have much of a choice. Maybe that's not why we can't use it right now, but it kind of seems to be. And that was kind of freaking amazing. By the way, I really got the fire effects in this game. They look really good, like genuinely. And I'm just trying to see, have any of our other party members leveled up yet? Is that what that yellow circle is around them, or is that something else? I don't know. Because, like, we're level 4, I don't think anyone's leveled up yet. Yeah, it's like on that, buddy. Boom! Oh, it looks like it did unfreeze him. Oh, maybe not. Wait a minute. Did your shield just deflect my, uh, my shots? Oh, it totally is. That's awesome. So I actually have to move around the targets. It's done. Here we go. Yeah, hey, what do you have? Lamb's wool? No! My lamb's wool!
There are mages here who can heal your wounds. Lie still. Don't... Don't touch me, Mother. Their magic is... Turn to noble purpose. Their magic is surely no more evil than your blade. But... Frankly, as a mage, I'm offended. Hush, dear boy. Allow them to ease your suffering. Mother Giselle? I am. And you must be the one they are calling the Herald of Andraste. Then I am. You're not against magic? What you said to that soldier? We do not teach that magic is evil. We teach that pride is evil and does not corrupt only mages. But I did not ask you to come simply to debate with me. Then why am I here? I know of the Chantry's denouncement, and I am familiar with those behind it. I won't lie to you. Some of them are grandstanding, hoping to increase their chances of becoming the new divine. Some are simply terrified. So many good people, senselessly taken from us. Yeah, but what do you got deal? So, don't you support the Chantry? But don't you stand with the rest of the Chantry? With no divine, we are each left to our own conscience. And mine tells me this. Go to them. Convince the remaining clerics you are no demon to be feared. They have heard only frightful tales of you. Give them something else to believe. Can't I just instill fear in them instead? And will that even work? That won't just make it worse? Because you are a mage. That too. Let me put it this way. You needn't convince them all. You just need some of them to doubt. Their power is the unified voice. Take that from them and you receive the time you need. That's genius. Are you sure? So I show up, say hello, show them the mark on my hand. I honestly don't know if you've been touched by fate or sent to help us, but I hope. Hope is what we need now. The people will listen to your rallying call as they will listen to no other. You could build the Inquisition into a force that will deliver us or destroy us. The latter sounds cooler. I will go to Haven and provide Sister Leliana the names of those in the Chantry who will be amenable to a gathering. It is not much, but I will do whatever I can. You damn well better, I just came and saved your ass. I want some kind of reward and also, your hat looks silly. All of you people have silly hats on. Take it from me, you know, I don't wear a hat, I just have cool looking horns. That's the way to go. Oh. Corporal Where Bayer is coordinating the Inquisition's efforts in the area. We should speak with him. Alrighty, that's what we're going to do next time. And we're also going to explore the area and loot everything that's not now down. And hopefully take on another boss or something. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, it was appreciated. I'll like and I'll see you next time for more Dragon Age Inquisition.